Hey everyone, welcome back to Maru Studio channel. Today, I'm sharing a script that converts raster images like this into vector formats with 4K quality, like this, with just a few clicks in Adobe Illustrator. The script supports up to 500 files in popular formats like SVG, EPS, 10, Illustrator AI, PDF, and even JPG and PNG images in 4K quality. Let's dive in! First, when you download it, you'll get a JS file. I've included a source folder to make the demo easier. Here, you can see I'm using JPG coloring book images for kids. There are two ways to add the script to Illustrator, manually each time you want to run it, or directly into Adobe Illustrator for quick access without repeating the process. Stick around until the end of the video, and I'll show you both methods. Method 1 Manually add the script and demo batch auto trace. First, open Adobe Illustrator obviously. Go to the menu, select file, then scripts and choose other script. Select the script file I provided and click open. A window will pop up with settings for your task. The most important part is the source folder. This is where your images are stored. I'll demo with these 10 images. Choose the file formats you want to export. I'm selecting JPG, AI, and EPS 10 common formats for microstock sites like Adobe Stock, FreePick, Shutterstock, and so on. Next, pick a trace preset. Choose one that suits your images. Since my coloring book images are simple, I'm going with Sketch Dart. That's it. Hit OK and wait for the results. The system will run automatically speed depends on how many files you're processing. No. Keep Adobe Illustrator active on your screen. Don't minimize it or switch to another app. I've built in some awesome features like auto-scaling artboards to match the image, smoothing vectors post-trace for softer lines, and exporting images at a minimum of 4K. And boom, it's done. And it didn't take long. Check the source folder for the results you'll see an output folder with the formats I set up, AI, EPS, and JPG. Looks great. Let's check the specs of this image. It's 5123x. 5123 pixels awesome. Now, let's see the quality. Hmm. Sharp, smooth lines. Looks great. Next, I'll open the EPS file in Adobe Illustrator to confirm it's fully vectorized. Oh, nice, the background separated. Let's take a look. Perfect, everything's converted to vectors and I can separate each part. All good, everything's working perfectly. Method 2, add the script directly to Adobe Illustrator. If you frequently work with image trace, this method will save you tons of time compared to the manual approach. First, copy the JSX file, then go to Applications, find the Adobe Illustrator folder, and select Presets. Next, choose N, US, then Scripts. This is where you paste the copied JSX file. If you're on Windows, note the file path and do the same. Paste the script file here, and you're done. Now, open Adobe Illustrator, go to File, and select Scripts. You'll see the script you just added listed there. Time to get started. As before, I'll select the source folder. Choose the files to export JPG and EPS10. And for the trace preset, I'll go with low fidelity photo this time. Click OK, and while the process runs, Grab a cup of tea or coffee to sip. And done. The process is complete. That's how you automatically trace multiple raster images to vectors. Wishing you success. If you found this helpful, please give me a like and subscribe to keep me motivated. Bye-bye.